Hey guys, it's me, Jenny B, and welcome back to last day of June. Last time we left off, we finished the, I want to call it a dream, but it was just going into the past, and we finished it, so I'm thinking, um, rewind. Okay, so, I was thinking we'd go into the other painting, but it won't let me do anything. <gasps> do I have to do it over? Do I have to keep doing it till I figure it out? Is that the thing? Oh, I don't know. I don't know what's going on at all. I am in my treehouse again, and there's my height. So maybe I do have to keep doing it till I figure it out. The kite got stuck, but it's locked. Hmm. Okay, so we know not to talk to the dog. And we should go up there to Grandpa before anything, I feel. There were a lot of stuff I could knock down with my ball, so I'm definitely gonna keep my ball around. Um, oh, I can view this. Did I view this last time? I don't think I did. I don't think I did. Last time, I didn't really get a chance to knock down a lot of flower pots, so I think I missed that one. Um, so I probably missed a couple of drawings or something. Sucks I can't do anything with that. Um, so that's locked. Oh, this is already knocked down. You don't want to talk to the dog. I need to get somebody to occupy my time. Okay, so yeah, no, not playing with you right now. Um, Grandpa's up here, so let's just head up real quick. Oh, jog. Nice, and go a lot faster. Okay, so I got my ball. Here's Grandpa. Oh, ooh, he just threw out his back. It was a large crack in his back. I don't know what you're saying, man. My kite! I need it under the tree. Okay, well, you're no help. Um... Well, I probably shouldn't knock down his flower pot since he's like right there. Um. Hmm. Okay, so I can use the rope to go down. I'm thinking to get my kite. But I have to get him away so I can sneak the rope. How can I do that? How can I do that? Oh. Oh. Okay. Okay. <laughs> ah! I'm run, 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 run. <laughs> Come on! Go, go, go! Oh, this is perfect. Okay. Going according to plan. I don't have my ball. Do I need that? Uh. I probably should have grabbed it. I was just trying to, like, run real quick. Ah! Ah! What? Can I go back up? No. No, I can't. Okay, so I'm hoping I can go through this gate, because I'm not really sure how else I would have been able to leave anyway. So this has to be open. Alright. Nice. Nice. 
And Grandpa's right up here. Is he still fixing the flower pot I knocked down? Or is he back to the old... Oh, did he move it? Where's my ball? Oh, he did move it. He did. Okay. So, how do I get my ball down there? I got it down there last time. I don't remember how. Did I not... Oh, okay, so I said, did I not drop it down there? Did I just, like, leave it up on the cliff? But there it is. It's right there. Okay. So, we're going to get the kite down. Right. Yes. Okay. Got her kite. Pretty easy. I don't know why I didn't figure that out the first time. Okay, so um I don't see where my ball went, so maybe the option of the dog is not even an option anymore. Oh, uh, who do I bring the kite to? Will Grandpa play kite with me? I don't know. Maybe the lady with the flowers? I still... <laughs> I really don't know what to do from this point. Okay. Hey. End the day. End the day. Is that it? Okay. He doesn't have a soccer ball anymore. He has the kite now. <laughs> Intrigued, Grandpa? Yes, he is. Even though I threw out fire back, I can still fly. <laughs> Never mind. Uh, he's got that nice shiny key, though. I wonder where that key goes. Yeah, well, I had to get my kite. And you were like... Bleh, bleh. So... I don't know what you want from me. Oh, well, that's handy. That works. So... Do they not get into an accident now? Does it not happen? Or does it still happen because it's raining? I guess we'll find out. <laughs> okay. Yes. I want to put this into play. He's not there. Nope. I'm not there. So, so what now? Is that it? I'm not sure. Is she alive? Can I still use my legs, Doctor? I don't know. Still driving our little car, though. <gasps> oh, well. The wheelchair's right there. <gasps> She made a different... It was a different nightmare this time. It was a different sound. It wasn't the car crash sound, so she still dies. Sometimes it's fate, dude. Sometimes you just have to accept destiny. That's how it's supposed to be. It's how it's supposed to be. Okay, so I guess we'll go and figure out... Uh, I got the achievement. I'm still here, dot, dot, dot. Yeah, we, we tried. We really tried, didn't we? Oh, I think the game might have crashed. Okay, so uh, I had to restart the game because it crashed. But I was able to hear her noise clear this time. Um, she sounded happy, to be honest. Sounded like she was having a blast almost. And he almost sounded happy waking up, too. Um, I meant to say this earlier, actually. I was looking at the achievements, and it actually says her name. And her name is June. Which, duh, last day of June, June, his name's Carl, so Carl and June, um, I didn't quite get the little boy's name, or anybody else's name, for that matter, um, I really hope it doesn't crash again, nice, made it through the doorway this time, okay, so let's see what's going on now, okay, let's remember, I concentrate real hard, Carl. I gotta remember. Quite curious how she goes. I forget who the next one was. Was it the woman in the cards? The next person to play? Oh! 
Yes. I could have waited. Could have waited, eh? I could have waited till they passed. Well, so now we have to figure out this chick. When I was the boy, and when I went over there to see her, she. I figured what she was doing. I think. It, I think it's something to do with flowers. Um, oh God, I really don't remember. She was by her truck and she was doing something and she looked super busy. Um, but I don't. Wait, this door open or this door? What door? This door? Okay, something opened and um, not quite sure what it was. What are you guys trying to tell me? Was it this? Oh, oh, oh. my bad. Oh, okay. Looking back at memories. Oh, this is when she was pregnant. <laughs> oh, feeling her belly. This, um, oh, little onesie. <laughs> I really wish I knew what they were saying. <laughs> but they sound happy. They sound like they are delighted. Um. So I got to wait, 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 wait. I wasn't able to get back here last time, was I? So that means I get to get to other places I wasn't able to reach before, like over here. Oh, she's going to labor. Oh, oh, oh! She's having the baby. She's got to go to the hospital. Okay, this is definitely the right way because there's the chick. Oh, what's happening? <gasps> Why is this so sad? I think she lost the baby. Even though there's a little boy, I'm not sure who's a little boy that is, I think she lost the baby. Which is really effing sad. Alright, gotta go to the portrait and try and figure out how we can change the past. Are we trying to change this past? Are we trying not to lose the baby? Is that even possible? If you knew you were gonna lose your baby ahead of time, could there be anything you could do? No, this just depends on the situation. Okay. Rude much. Don't need to be slamming doors. Save her. Save my wife. Save June. Okay. So many different noises. I heard writing, but then I heard moaning, and then I heard crunkling up, crinkling papers. Something of that debris. Oh. Is it the same day? Oh, I guess it would be. She keeps dying on the same day, so. I guess it would be the same day. Uh. She's looking at pictures. Did she love him? Oh my god, this is getting so dramatic. Was she the other woman? Ugh. The heartache. The heartbreak. You didn't win him over, did you? She had something that you just didn't have. And you decided to kill her with your boxes. Oh, there's the can opener. 
Yeah, you gotta go return it. Use that as an excuse to see his face. It works. Okay, so... Oh, I ah. thought we would have done it. Ah. Use your can opener! Oh, God, my heart just drops for her. She's kind of like, I'm a fool. So what else are we doing now? We're just gonna get rid of these boxes? I don't understand why she threw the whole album in the garbage. I'm sure there's salvable pictures in there. There's other pictures. You know? But what ifs? Just throw the whole album away. It's all good. Looks like a heavy box. Alright, so I'm loading up the truck. Oh, she hears them. She's like, Oh, don't make it that obvious. Come on, you're not that desperate, are you? Off they go. To the lake, the beach, wherever they go. The boat. The boats. Not quite sure what I can do though to change this. Okay, three to six. Six o'clock she dies. All right. Can I finally control her? Is she moving? Is that it? Chick, she dies. Like, you totally have a chance. Oh, look at her. Look at her walk around so daintily, like, ooh, ooh. Very nice. She's very <laughs> graceful. Wait, do I want to do this? Hold on. Hold on. What we don't want to do is what the story is. So we don't, we want to hold off. Let's just hold off that last box. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Can we check over here? Nothing. Can we go over here? Nope. <laughs> Jesus, lady. Oh, there we go. There's some running. There's some running. All right. Jog that little heart out. Okay. Okay, I'm not quite sure. I mean, I have to convince her to stay, I'm guessing. I'm guessing I have to convince her to not move. That's where the box goes. Yes, that's where the box is. Thank you very much for that insight. Oh, that's creepy. That looks like the little spirited people from uh, Princess Mononoke. The little mountain spirits that like jiggle their head. You guys know what I'm talking about. Don't act like you don't know. You know. Um. Oh, 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 oh. Her head, her head was in the yard. Their yard, June and Carl's yard. I could get it when I was the kid. Can I get it now? It was over here in this corner, wasn't it? Wasn't it? <sighs> I know. Wasn't it? I thought it was, I thought it was here. When I was a little boy. Or is it over there? Oh, I can still get it. I guess that's cool. Okay. Three out of twenty. Oh, okay. So, the little boy lives somewhere else. He doesn't live where June and Carl live. So, I guess that makes him... Somebody else's little boy. I keep hearing a little baby. <laughs> Is it them flying the kite? Can I pet you? 
I can't do nothing with the dog. Uh, I have no idea. Ooh, I hear somebody grumbling. Oh, yeah, there's the, the hunter. Where is he? Ah! He's over here. Okay. Nah. Oh, he's, she doesn't want to talk to him. I don't think they like each other very much. Um, can I go visit the kid and Grandpa? I think that's who the dog is barking at. Where are they flying the kite? Down here? I hear him laughing. Oh, okay, here they are. What are you guys doing? What's up? Oh, okay, I'll just, you know, go about my way. Do they do anything else if I greet them again? A new. That is a new. Okay, so maybe I do have to take one step at least. Like, maybe I should put the box in the truck and see what it does. Um. I mean, there's only really one person I can, like, talk to. And that's the hunter, and she doesn't want to talk to him. Is this my house? Well, my used to be house? Yes. Mmm. <gasps> Oh my gosh, she's carrying that really quickly. Quicker than I thought she would. Okay. Oh, 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 oh. oh should I go slowly? Do I have to do the long way around? Seriously, you can't just be careful? Just be careful in the leaves, just walk slow. I mean, it's not rocket science. Everybody can do it. Oh, there's leaves over here, though. So what am I supposed to... Uh. Can I run on it? Uh. Go away, leaves. So I have to find a rake. Or a leaf blower. Something. Oh, so I can run on them, no problem. Can I go back in my house? Okay, so I guess my rake's not in my house. Frick, where do I find a rake? How can I get rid of these leaves? Oh, is that a rake right there? Sticking up out of that big pile of leaves right there? How do I get over there, though? How do I get over there? Alright, so... Is that June and Carl's house? I mean, I was just over there returning his... Oh, wait, 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 wait. This is blinking. I mean, we could duck under it. Correct? Wait, why do, Why are we looking at this? <sighs> so we need something heavy. My box. My box. My box is so heavy. My box is the heaviest box you will ever see. Does that work? Alright. Now I can take this rake. Break these leaves. Right? Break. <laughs> ah. Ah. <gasps> these leaves just disappear into thin air when I rake them. It's so wonderful. Should I rake over here too? I mean, might as well. <laughs> what? That is rakeable. <laughs> Don't play with me, child. <laughs> All right. <laughs> Break those leaves. Break those leaves. Can I do anything else with the rake? Is there anything else I can do with this rake? Because I really don't want to get in my car. Because when I do, that storm over there is going to come. And June's going to die again. Which really is in this woman's best interest, if I were to be completely honest. She literally should probably, you know, just, you know, keep going. Keep going as it is. 
I'm kind of curious though if there's more than one ending to this. Because maybe I could leave her story as is and then her and Carl could end up happily ever after. Interesting. His laugh is so adorable. Okay, go that way. I could listen to this little kid laugh. Probably the whole episode. Oh, I see another one of her things. Over there. How do I get over there? There's a gate here, but I don't think I could reach it. Can I use the rake? I mean, why not? Why can't I use the rake? Why can't I just tap over the swole? How do I get over there? What? What? How is it even possible? Okay, I literally walked around this whole place, didn't find any more places to... Didn't find anything else to rake. Well, except this. I can rake this. Can't I just spend my whole time raking and then they could just come and drive by and they can leave when they get here? I mean, that's possible. I can do that, right? Let's open this. Might be useful. I didn't go over here yet. Let's open this too. No, don't rake. Open the gate. Seiko. What kind of person just rakes gravel? Is this the hunter? No, it's the little boy. Did I get that one? I don't think I did. Hmm. Well, that's it. I don't... Can I be a stalker and bring him to their house? Can I just sniff his pillow one last time? And put on his jacket? Just for a final farewell. Okay, let's put this right back. Yep, just hand it right back in the leaves, yep. Because that's physics. Can I just get in the car now? Oh, I need my box! Oops! Forgot my box. Um, there's also a thing like that over here. But I don't know if I can get to it. Can I get to it from my house? No! Dang it! Cause I was like, maybe there's something that way. But I don't know. I'm really not sure how to proceed. <sighs> that looks stable. Yeah, sure. Oh, the rope. The rope. They're using the rope for the kite. Alright. So I guess we go check out what Grandpa and Kit's doing. And, um... You know, I don't know what to do if I don't have the rope. If I don't have the rope, all my boxes will fall everywhere. <laughs> if you don't give me the rope, Jude will die. <laughs> Selfish little brat. Is that in the day? Wait, why did that pop up and he go, huh? Do I have to redo his? Is there, is there like a third option of how to do the kids? I don't understand. I don't, I, I don't know. Uh, I don't know. I think he's like realizing that I've changed the future now that I've changed the past. Like now that I'm using the rope for the kid, she still dies because I don't know. I don't know all this time stuff. It's 
time junk. I don't even know. I don't know. I don't want to end the day. I don't know what else to do. You really shouldn't drive off with your boxes like that, though. Like, ugh. You should just wait till they're done flying the kite. That should be an option. Because you can still use the rope. I really am so unsure. I didn't see another rope anywhere. I didn't see anything I could use to tie down my stuff. It's still going to be the same thing. Bah! We're going to have to retry this one, too. It's so bogus. <clears throat> Alright, yeah, let's start the car. Our boxes are still going to fall. Maybe I can knock them all down right now. No, it won't let me. It's not raining yet. Can we go right? Let's go right. No, she wants to go left, even though I hit right. And June dies at 7 o'clock. So I have an hour. I have an hour to save June's life. She doesn't have the rope. I know. Tell me about it. Maybe I can get... It's still the boxes. <gasps> Oh, all her stuff fell out. I didn't even realize. Alright, can we just wait? Can we just wait for them to drive by? I know the second I hit A. The second I hit A, they're going to be like, Oh, this is when we decided to drive by. There we go. I call it a freak out like that. You could just hit the brakes, Carl. You uh you saw her from a good distance. <gasps> okay, you guys, I'm gonna end that episode here. The next episode, I'm gonna try and figure out how to do uh, moving box ladies timeline to make sure June doesn't die. Uh, it's gonna take some thinking, definitely, and some working on it. Um, but it is intriguing to know that she secretly loves Carl, and I. Wonder if he sees this since he's going to these pictures and he's seeing everything. And when we had that little moment uh, when she asked the kid and grandpa for the rope, you could hear his voice going, huh, like he figured something out. So I feel like he definitely is watching this. So it's kind of funny to know that now he knows her secret. So thank you guys so much for checking out this episode of Last Day in June. And I hope you check out the next one. And I'll catch you guys later. Mm.